Alrighty then. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Priscilla. So, we did Star last week from Star vs. the Forces of Evil. So let's go ahead and draw Marco from Star vs. the Forces of Evil. What I want to do first is draw his head. So we're just going to draw a regular circle. After my regular circle, I'm going to go ahead and bring out one side of his face. Then I'm going to go ahead and create that eye line. After the eye line, what I want to do is place his eye. So I'm going to go ahead and put one eye here, and it's going to come off to the side just a little bit and go off the side of the face. I'm going to jump over off to the side just a little bit of distance. And go ahead and create his other eye in the bottom of the eye going alongside that eye line. Erase this part where you just keep them all nice and rounded. Then I'm going to go ahead and jump over here and give him his pupil iris. And jump over here and give him his other pupil iris. And he doesn't have really have shine in his eyes. He has brown eyes. So go ahead and fill that in for his pupils. After that, I'm going to go ahead and jump in the middle and give him just like a little bit of a nose. So you're going to bring it out this way and then bring it back in. And for his mouth, I'm going to go a little bit right here and then I'm going to make another spot right there. And what I'm going to do is connect those two spots and then a little mark right here underneath his eye. After that, I'm gonna go right up to here and create the top part of his hair. So I'm gonna start up here to where I could have a good part. So I have this part this way and this part going down. So I'm gonna bring out this part. Up. Bring out this part. The little choppy part right here. Bring this in, jump on top, and flirt out this one. So we have a little bit of a bang going out this way, going down. Go ahead and bring down his forehead to where it's going outwards. And what's funny is his eyebrows are actually up in his hair. So we have one eyebrow right here. So we're going to make a line here and bring it out this way. Kind of looks like a tiger claw. And then we have another one, another tiger claw going this way. And it's hidden inside of his hair. <laughs> so it's super cute, super funny. Then I'm going to go ahead and bring down this side of his hair and go outwards just a little bit. Then I'm going to jump over here, bring down the rest of his hair, go back into his head. So after that, I'm going to go ahead and give him one ear over here. And I need to go ahead and give him his ear over here. I got an ear and an ear. I'm going to erase this part. And then I'm going to go ahead and bring in this part of his hair and then another part. So it goes one little piece, two little piece. And I'm just gonna go through his hair and then make that little spot like the earlobe, pretty simple. And then we just have one little spot over here, just a line to define the earlobe. I'm gonna bring out that cheek just a little bit more. So we can go ahead and finalize that his whole entire face. Then I'm gonna jump underneath his head and give him a neck. So it's pretty simple, just right underneath his head, just a neck here, neck here. Circle this off and give him a V neck. And I'm just, you see, I'm not going straight up to his neck, I'm going behind his neck just to give that indication of a shirt. And then I'm going to go behind his neck 
bring down one side here, go back behind his neck again, and bring down the other side. I'm gonna bring up this side just a little bit more, look like it's overlapping. And I'm gonna do the same to over here. Bring it up like it's overlapping, like it's back behind his shoulders and resting behind his shoulders. Then I'm gonna go ahead and bring down one shoulder here. Jump over off to the side and bring down the shoulder right here. So bring this down, bring this down. And I'm gonna start cur curving inwards. Bring this down, start curving inward. And I'm gonna bring down the other side of his shoulder. And then I'm gonna go ahead and bring down one side of his arm right here. Bring this down, and I'm gonna jump in here and give him that elbow area, and I'm gonna jump off to the side and do the exact same thing where you bring down the other side of his arm, just like I did right here. Go ahead and bring down this part, and then we're actually gonna go right in the middle, make a line right there, bring it down, go over here, bring this one down, but I'm going outwards, so just like I did this one, I'm gonna do the exact same thing where I go outwards, and then round it back in. I'm gonna go ahead and make sure his arm is fully tucked inside his, the pouch of his hoodie. I'm gonna bring this hoodie to an actual point, and bring down the zipper down here and then across his pouch. And then after that, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go ahead and bring around this part so it'll give that like ending point to the hoodie. And I'm gonna go underneath. And box it off at the bottom. So I go underneath here, and then underneath here. And I close it off. And go ahead and clear up some guideline. After that, I'm gonna go ahead and bring down one side of his legs here, and then one side of his legs over here. And then we're gonna bring it down just a little bit more. And then I'm gonna go ahead and bring out one line that going this way, and then one line going this way. And you just go ahead, bring it down. All the way down. And his leg, his the actual bottom of his legs go out just a little bit because they're like crumbled up. So this one's gonna go out just a little bit. And this one will go out just a little bit. And I'm gonna make a little line right here at the bottom and then a line right here at the bottom. Just to show that his pants are bunched up at the bottom. Also, I almost forgot, he's got two little hairs sticking out the back of his head. So I got one, two, and I'm gonna go ahead and color in his hair and color in his eyebrows so we can see the difference. And there you go. There's how to draw Marco from Star vs. the Forces of Evil. So there you go, there are two main characters from Star vs. the Forces of Evil. I haven't really watched the show. I tried to watch like the first episode I s explained in Star's tutorial and I just really couldn't get into it as much as I got into Gravity Falls. But yeah guys, I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see y'all later. Bye!